Hi everybody, my name is Bill Black at Spirit River. It's my pleasure to show you how to tie a mohair leech. It's a fairly easy fly to tie. It's extremely effective for any kind of lake fishing. Bass love it, trout love it. So I highly recommend that you buy this kit and you tie a whole bunch of these flies because you and your buddies are going to have a ball with them. Um, this is the fly tying kits, an example of what we sell. We're going to have this kit available in the kit you'll have 24 flies, a couple two or three different size hooks, and you're going to have different colors of mohair, which is the body material right here. You're going to have a couple colors of marabou, and we're probably going to throw in a little package of light bright, like this, if you'd like to do an underbody of light bright. Here is the mohair leech yarn that we sell. This is all UV2, meaning it's a double dye process for UV fluorescence as well as UV reflectance. Okay, so let's get started. What I'm going to do is take a 3x long nymph hook. The Spirit River hook that we're using right here is a N063, N for nymph. Uh, it's a 3 on that, so it's a uh, 3x long hook. This particular one is a size 6. Uh, next I'm going to take a little bit of lead wire and I'm going to add that just to secure that bead. It's a Spirit River Bright bead so there's a small hole on one side which goes up against the eye. There's a larger hole on the other. That will slip right up into that bead as such. Then I go ahead and I add my thread and I go in and I cover that lead wire, put a bump right behind it so it doesn't go anywhere. There we go. Uh, again, I create a base of thread that all the materials stick to so the fly won't rotate. It'll stay together better. It takes only a second to do that. It makes a world of difference in the quality of your fly. Now, I've gone ahead and taken, um, I think it was this one, medium UV2 medium brown marabou. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a chunk of this marabou, put it in my fingers and make sure that all the tips are relatively even. I'll take my scissors like this and I'll cut a little piece out, stroke it so that I can see that I've got a nice even tail. I measure it so it's about the length of the hook shank. I'll tie that in. I go ahead and clip that nice and short. I'm going to take a little bit of gold or copper wire, whatever you have handy. Again, that will be included in the kit. I'm going to tie that in. Now I'm going to take my yarn and I'm going to take two of my yarns Now you don't have to put light bright under the body if you don't want uh, If you want to touch a flash to it you can. A lot of people like that, a lot of people don't so do as you please I've got a little light bright pearl blue olive peacock bronze peacock is another really killer color take a little bit of this light bright there we go and I'll just take this mohair really helps on this mohair too if you can scuff it up a little but if you do that then you've got to pull it all back just a wee as you wrap it now you can kind of see a light bright coming through look at that nice and buggy Get a little, a 
right up behind the eye of the hook. I'm going to take one more wrap. Oh, that's a beauty. Trim that off. Sweep it all back. Get ready for your whip finish. This is really a, a great little beginner fly. Um, it's really fast and easy to tie. Not too worried about knocking those fibers down a little bit with this wire simply because I'm going to go back with my dubbing brush and pluck a lot of it out. wee bit of super glue to the eye of the hook just to make sure that thread doesn't come undone. A little bit of that light bright shine through. And what I like to do is I like to lift all that material up and just give it one little trim like that. Make sure there's no more really wild, crazy, loose hairs. And there you have an extremely effective uh, leech. As you can see, it's just, it's gorgeous. And this will wiggle through the water as it swims because of the bead. Bill Black reporting to you from Spirit River headquarters. We're a small family owned company here in Oregon. We appreciate your support. Please support our dealers throughout the country. If you have any problems with anything, give us a call. We're here to help you. You can visit spiritriver.com. We have a ton of different materials, real high quality stuff. Um, again, support our dealers and be sure to buy some of our fly tying kits. Thanks a lot. Have a good day.